Hey, so I found this book at one of the record stores, uh, one of my local record stores. They have, you know, a uh, shelves of music books. You know, I always go in there and check to see if they have any Elvis books. So I, I found this one. It's the Elvis album. It came out in 1991. Uh, basically, it's kind of like uh, the way it's presented. It's kind of like, you know, like a scrapbook kind of book with different um, articles about Elvis throughout his career nothing on the back and this is the side view of it so let's just open up real quick uh and see what what we got here some young pictures of Elvis um I'll try to do this really quick because uh I don't want to make such a big long video but uh it, it's a pretty cool cool book uh what I like about it is it, it kind of gives you kind of like articles that they've written about Elvis and during his lifetime, um, different pictures of the magazines that he was in. Uh, so, you know, we got some early, like, you know, Sun Studios, uh, Sun Records, you know, and, uh, uh, so it's, it's a pretty cool, um, again, this book came out in 1991. Um, so you get to see kind of some of the articles that were written about him and, uh, to give you kind of like samples of, of stuff like that and pictures throughout his his career, you know, posters. Um, this is probably was really a cool book probably to get your hands on back in the in the early 90s before the, you know, the internet, you know. Uh, some really good, you know, pictures and stuff. And a lot of these pictures, again, like I've said in previous book reviews, you know, pictures that we've seen before, um, but that probably at the time when this book was, was made, it was probably, you know, rare pictures. Um, this one with the Colonel, I've seen that one many times. And they talk about the famous, famous picture it was used a lot in promoting Elvis during the, during the fifties. It's really, uh really interesting pictures of his of, of his career you know throughout his career uh there with uh milton burl uh, with one of his girlfriends june and that's kind of like you know a lot of th times when you when you read more about all this you realize about his other relationships a lot of people like you know just say, oh it's just priscilla but you know he had other other girlfriends even you know even before her and that's cool I'll give you some, the covers of what the magazines were you know that poster I've seen that poster a lot look at that even on the <laughs> the tv guide does anybody get the TV Guide today? <laughs> uh, some really great pictures. What is this Elvis teddy bear? <laughs> Upper theme, I guess. That's what it is. All the merchandise and stuff. One thing about, you know, bad about Colonel Parker, I mean, a lot of people say that, you know, Colonel Parker was, was bad. And he, a lot of stuff he did was bad, but he, I mean, he was really, you know, good at promoting Elvis and, you know, and making that, you know, <laughs> making money off him. <laughs> Is he the new James Dean, you know, back in in the 50s when, when Elvis started to make movies, you know, they, you know, he had the chance to really be that next big movie star and uh no unfortunately i mean you know throughout the 60s it didn't didn't work out some uh, movie posters um let me tender pictures of Famous picture, Jerry, Lew Jerry Lee Lewis, Carl Perkins, Johnny Cash, and Elvis. Million Dollar Quartet. And I got, you know, purchasing Graceland.
this is a cool picture. Elvis and DJ Dewey Phillips visit a local record store. Famous, you know, gold outfit suit. different pictures of the movies you know and then like like i said they have like different like uh pictures of the different magazines that he was in you can just go read through the articles it, it, it's interesting to, to go back and read some of these little article snippets of like what was written about him when he was alive um and the jailhouse rock uh and then his article about the co-star that was killed in a car accident. Um, but, uh, yeah, I mean, it's interesting because, you know, now, you know, when a lot of the stuff that you read now is like when, you know, when he went after, after, you know, he died. But just to see the different things that were written about him, and, you know, when he was alive and just to see like, uh, that's an interesting picture. Um, all the magazine covers that he was on and all that. King Creole. In the studio. And the, the army days. Uh, or magazine posters, the movie star. And this is this is the section all about you know the movies in the sixties, you know. GI Blues. All these. If anybody has any of these these old magazines, they're probably worth something today. I used to have a TV guide, I think, from the '90s. I, I don't have it anymore, but it was uh, Elvis was on the cover. It was from the night I believe it was probably from the '90s. It was probably one of those anniversaries, you know, one of of, of his death. And he was on the cover. I ha I had saved it for a, uh, for a number of years, but I, my, I probably I don't know, it's been lost. But uh, he had one of those TV guides. Uh, Blue Hawaii. That was probably the ad you would see. Then you remember before the internet, you had to go in the newspaper and look at uh, the movie uh, times, and and that was just, huh, back in the day. Uh, you know. I remember, you know, growing up when I was a kid and you know, my dad would go to the newspaper to look at movie times and stuff. And that was, now you just go on the internet. A lot of the world has changed. Girls, girls, girls. <laughs> it happened at the World Fair. Articles and reviews of uh, of his movies. Um, uh, Rust about. I actually enjoy that movie. Um, is Elvis worth a million dollars? I guess. Girl happy.
Elvis acting, still limps after 10 years, 12 movies, trouble in his paradise. I guess uh, towards the end of it, Elvis's movie career when things were not, were not going well. Article about the wedding uh, with Priscilla. Oh, this is married. All right. Um. So let's end this video here, and I'll do a part two, finishing it up. Um. So uh, thanks for watching.